I'm Greg Took, host of my Big Fat Bloody Mary podcast, and I love hanging out with Shelly Buchanan. Who wouldn't? I am here at David Ray's in Onalaska, Wisconsin, and I'm with the amazing Greg Took from my Big Fat Bloody, Bloody Mary. Woo! Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> We're drinking some Bloody Marys today, and I'm going to ask Greg a few questions now, all right? Bring it on, bring okay. it on. Um, so, how did we meet? How did, like, I know we met for the first time in January in person, but how did we yeah. meet? Like, how did we know each other? I don't even remember. That's a great, wow, I haven't even thought of that. I don't know, that. right? It it's probably, been years. It has been years. Yeah. yeah. Um, I probably it was me stalking you on social media because A, yes, yeah. you like Bloody Marys, mm -hmm. and B, you're easy on the eyes. Oh, I am? We'll let the viewers yeah, decide. Yeah, okay, okay, we'll see. We'll, we'll put up a poll, I guess. I don't know. Yeah, what do you think? <laughs> easy on the eyes? Yeah. Hard on the eyes. <laughs> I think they'd be more interested in this. Well, so. that's what I was talking about. Oh, yeah, about. yeah, no, exactly. What did you think I, of that? Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. No, I, we met on Facebook. I, I, it was Facebook, but it was like five years or something, right? I think one of the first oh, no. photos, yeah. I just remembered this. I think you were in a wedding gown with a Bloody Mary. Was that a picture? Really? Maybe, did you have a, uh, I don't know. Maybe, maybe I imagine that. I don't know. Yeah. You're imagining a future wedding? Is that what happens? <laughs> what were you wearing at the time? A, <laughs> a smile. Yeah, pretty much. Some garnish. Some garnish. Yeah. <laughs> Celery in one hand, and we won't talk about the other hand. Well, <laughs> it's your show. <laughs> yeah, you want to talk about yeah, I know, I know. Yeah. Okay, yeah. yeah. I don't know. I just remember, I remember buying one of your shirts. Thank you. They're rich as the 9 a.m. Well, I, I bought this one. Yeah, I have this one too. Yeah, yeah, no, plug it, plug it for sure. No, I'm sold out on it. Never mind. Oh, okay. Right. You can't even buy it. That's how amazing it is. Right? You can't yeah. get this. No. Yeah, oh well. No, I had the original, the it's 9 a.m. somewhere one. I got that one. Yeah. Because that was a long time ago. Yeah, that was four years ago. Yeah, that was four years ago. Yeah. Huh. It's been a hell of a ride. It has been. Yeah. And now we're here in Wisconsin yeah. visiting you. Finally. You live here, right? Yeah. Yeah. I've been mad as hell about that, but finally. I know. We brought this guy. I mean, you can't see him over here, but he old, came along. Old what's his name? <laughs> old what's his name came out with as us. As I like over to refer to him. Yeah, yeah. 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 <laughs> Not much of a personality, but the guy can make a pretty good Bloody He can make a pretty good Bloody Mary. And speaking of Bloody Marys, all right, what are we doing here today? Yeah. Tell us about this. So, I'm humble. Okay. Shelly Buchanan of the Drunken Tomato comes to my town, as does Dimitri of Dimitri's Bloody Mary seasonings. It's like this huge summit. So I set up a couple of events. This is one of them. And as you mentioned, David Ray's really a nice place. It's kind of new, but really a good vibe. Yeah. They do a Bloody Mary bar every Sunday. And I kind of, I have some pull, a strong arm. And I basically took all of those mixes that they normally yeah, offer. Yeah, yeah. Bam, out. We just took Throw over. Them over. Put all them on the sidewalk. You don't need them. Yeah, you don't need Kick them. Kick them to the curb. Yeah. One of them had a green label. Ooh, and yeah. starts with the letter Z. I don't know. I don't know. It's out of here, out of here. No yeah. room, no room for that. So yeah, we got all four of the Dimitri's flavors and uh, this is my eighth one. And by <laughs> golly, it's as good as the seventh. <laughs> that's great. That's it's my math right yeah. Seven is before eight, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's yeah. been a long day. It has. And it's only gonna keep getting longer. I know, right? <laughs> Which flavor did you get? Now there's four. This is the classic. So, okay. like on the spectrum of heat, this would be the lower end. Yeah, yeah. Uh, but the seventh one was the chilies and peppers. Okay. It's, Which one's your favorite, though? Ah, uh, you don't I, have a favorite. I think the chilies and peppers. Oh, really? That's kind of my okay. go-to. Good. Well, I have the extra horse radish, and that yes. one's my favorite. That was my third one. Today. Also a good one. <laughs> also, also a good. Favorite. Also a good one for number three. Yeah. yeah. But which one do you end on? I don't know. The day is young, young. Shelly. Time, time. We got time. Time will tell. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> All right. So you have 
So I do these things where it's I like, saw you, know, it, like you know, the mechanism. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. You gotta shake yeah. out all that excess energy, yeah. right? Get it. That's what I do yeah. for. No, exactly. Uh, so my big fat bloody Mary. You started that how many years ago? Um, it was in the, well, it was during the depression. Right? Yeah, and yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I had a low period back in 2012. No, I, I, I think I've had it going for about eight years now. Yeah, yeah. Yep. So. And it just started as a website to share recipes. Yeah. And uh, it exploded. Uh, this was the kind of earlier days of the Google the algorithm. The wild, wild west. Yeah, yeah, and so yeah. like a Yahoo like me could get rankings of the Wazoo. <laughs> I remember uh, particular Thanksgiving, I got 7,000 unique visitors that came Whoa. to the site. Right. Damn! Uh, it made me think. Yeah. Yeah. So, back then I didn't really know what to do with it. It was just a lot of right. traffic, it was a lot of fun. But I, I always wondered, why Thanksgiving? Why, why is everybody looking for... Because they hate their families, that's why. That's exactly <laughs> there's, it. there's like anything to get me away. That's what I came to. Right, yeah. It has to be, it has to be. Yeah. yeah. So, but yeah, in, in the meantime, uh, I added all kinds of things. I started making t shirts and selling those, and um, we did a, obviously we have a Facebook page and an Instagram. But uh, then we started the podcast. So yeah. My Big Fat Blood Mary Podcast. Which is amazing. Go listen oh, to man. it. Uh, we actually recorded an episode yesterday. We did. Episode We recorded something yesterday. I don't know. We, we were all pretty. Uh, we, I haven't edited yeah. yet. Yeah. My hard fast rule is record drunk, edit sober. <laughs> I have not been in a position to edit yet. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. That, for at least another 24 hours you won't be. At least. At least. At yeah, least. It's been yeah. a hell of a ride. It has been. Yeah. It's been great. I mean, somebody lost their underwear once already. Uh, we're not talking about who. <laughs> his initials are Dimitri. <laughs> That did happen, didn't it? It did happen. Yeah. Yeah. daisies. You know, it's, it's yeah. okay. I lost a pair of pants in a bar once. I mean, at least things happen. Can you tell us more about that? I don't. I don't know much more than I lost. It was a bar in like the East Village, and I came in with pants, and I left without them. You know, I went to try to find them the next day, and they were like, I called them, and they were like, yeah, no, we actually found your pants. And so I went all the way back to the East Village, and I show up, and I'm like, hey, you guys have my pants. They're like, we don't have your pants. I was like, are you guys punking me? Like, I don't know. I got a party with you, cowgirl. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know that I've ever lost my pants. I've lost my shirt on a few deals, but. Minneapolis, I just did. A couple months ago, I lost two of my jackets on two different occasions. Yeah. Yeah. But I don't, it's, I don't know, you know, you, you give it to God. I feel like you give your clothing out there and then right. you get Bloody Marys in return. Like it's, Is that it's a how it works? Yeah, yeah. So you live in La Crosse here. Uh, what's your favorite bar to go to for a Bloody Mary in La Crosse? David Ray's. <laughs> Other than David Rays, which stupid. we are here, come on, yes. <laughs> no, I'll tell you, lacrosse, we are blessed. It's been said that we have a world record for the most bars on one street. Um, really? Yeah, at one point we were in the Guinness Book of World Records for that. Huh. Uh, so we have a lot of choices. And, and you have the world's largest six pack. We do, but I'm working on it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Um, but there are a lot of great places to get Bloody Marys. In Wisconsin, I think we're kind of known for it. We like drinking. And we like you things that say. are... The hell you better. Yeah, but uh, there's a lot of great places. And I, I could go through and name them, but uh, who's got to know? Yeah, you just gotta come here to lacrosse and visit you. I think that's that's what happened. Would it kill you? No, no. I mean, I mean, Andy. I mean, you have these epic house parties. We had them yesterday. Yeah. yeah. We didn't get to have the live music, but you have that often. Right? I do. Yeah. yeah. I host. A, it's called the Bloody Mary Concert Series. Mm -hmm. um, I don't know how I do it by hook or crook, but I get these artists from Nashville, all over the well, all over the, all over the world. Really, yeah. I have a German punk band. <laughs> That's, fun. That's fun. awesome. Yeah, yeah. So we do that too. You may speak Always a little bit of German. Do you? Yeah, no. I took I took four years in high school and then uh, another year. So how would you say, damn, Greg, you're good looking. Are you seeing it in German? Uh, 
So, okay. Uh, damn, Greg. That one's easy. Mm. Damn, Greg. Uh, you're good looking. Uh, do best shona. Um, are you seeing anyone? Um, are, I don't know how you'd say seeing. Be like dating. No, I don't know that one. So you can lie in two languages. Do best shona. But like when I'm I try, impressed. when I try to go to you know vacation or whatever, I just got back from Peru. And I'll try to think of a word in Spanish, and immediately my brain will just go into German, and then I'll have to translate it out of German and then into Spanish. So it's, it's your first, up. second language. Uh, yeah, I know. I don't know why. Yeah. Well, you're ahead of me. I, I, I'm not that good at English. It's you sound great. You sound amazing. Thank you. Yeah, once we got your mic to work here, you know. <laughs> yeah, we had some technical problems. Some technical problems. problems. I don't Weird. know. I wasn't picking you up. Yeah. Yeah. Apparently the mics don't pick up asshole very well. Hi-oh! <laughs> yeah, I'm like invisible in mirrors and yeah. inaudible on microphones. It's a thing. Yeah. 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 Way to pick guests. <laughs> <laughs> Hopefully your next interview will go better. Probably not. I mean, you know, we basically just go to bars and bullshit while drunk. So. What could go wrong? What could go wrong? I mean, Please. as long as everything records, um, fine. I don't know if the camera picks this up or not, but you're not wearing pants right now. I usually don't wear we pants for wanna... any of the interviews. I feel like, you know, it gives me a one-up on my guests. Right. right? It keeps I... them on the toes. It so. kind of does. Like, yeah. You know, I don't want to point it out or anything, but did you forget something? I wasn't yeah. going to say anything. See? Yeah. yeah. But then halfway through, you're like, okay, maybe now it's time. Well, because you lost them that one time yeah, in Minneapolis. Well, and then I never found them again. Right. It's ever since then, it's, I have a thing with pants. I mean, I'm very big into moo moos right now, actually. Really? Yeah, I really love the moo moos. Like, just put me in a potato salad. Yeah. Like it's, yeah, it's like you just let it all hang out. Shit. It's very comfortable. Anybody could pull yeah. it off, Shelly. I don't know if I pull it off, but I'm having a hell of a time. I would try. pull it off. <laughs> Hello. Where's my room shot? <laughs> Badu. <laughs> Speaking of which, Mm. Turns out Dimitri's quite a drummer. Did you catch that? I know, I Holy know. Cow. That was amazing. I had no idea. Yeah. Like, yeah, we jammed out for a while. Well, you guys well, jammed out. I sat on the couch and enjoyed it. Four in the it. morning. Oh, that's it. Yeah, just till four in the morning. Yeah, that was pretty funny. <laughs> not too shabby. Yeah, not too bad. All right, Dimitri, you want to come in here and, and chat with Greg? Sure. For a little bit? What did, what did I say? What did I say? What is Later! Later! Alright, all right. So, finally made it out here after how many years? Way too many. Yeah, I've been electronic friends for four four years or something. Four yeah, five, I something think like about that. that. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I finally made it out to Portland and chastised me for not taking an hour and a half drive to Portland. Uh, and I was all encumbered with kids and other responsibilities. And I promised you, I said, yeah. since I was such a lame ass, not driving <laughs> down to Portland to right. see you, I I'm going to fly. Bit. Yeah out here to lacrosse and did I make it happen or what? I, I even brought Shelly. That's that's the real uh, frosting on the cake right well, there. Right, and it's nice to yeah. see you, but uh, <laughs> is Shelly seeing anybody? Do you know by the way? Uh, I, she can't hear me right now, can she? <laughs> I think I she's actively seeing a vodka soda. Oh, yeah, she's yeah. in a relationship and it's complicated. It's complicated. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah. Man. So thanks for Welcome hosting, man. It's, uh, yeah, it's it a great time. It's a great an time. An honor and a privilege to have you. I am. The mean, honor is mine. The honor is mine. Hanging out with Mr. Ago? Big Fat. I'm working on Mr. That. Big Fat. I know. Yeah, that's yeah. a good one. I'm gonna start calling you so that, formal. Mr. Big Fat. He is <laughs> just call me big and fat. But no, I remember distinctly uh, about five years ago, yeah. I got a little package in the mail uh, out of Tucson, Arizona, from my brother. Uh, he had discovered your mix. Yeah. He sent me these packets. And he says, "Great, you got to try this stuff." And I, I kind of threw it aside because. I'm not complaining. If anybody wants to send me a free sample, go for it. I get a lot of them. And most of them, sorry, they suck. And I just I gotta put it aside, I didn't pay attention to it. Pulled it out one day and mixed up the bloody it. I called him right in, like, wait, like, where the hell did you get this stuff? This is really good. <laughs> so I've been a fan ever since. Well, thank you. Finally meet you. I'm here for you. I'm drinking one right now. Thanks to Mike. It was Mike, right? It was Mike, yeah. yeah. Mike. Thanks, Mike. Oh, our Mexican brother. Yes. <laughs> yeah. 
So did you have any other questions? Wait, who's the interviewer? <laughs> oh, yeah. Well, I left the house with panties. Yeah. Uh, I, I'm not, I'll have to check. I may have lost them again or something. Yeah. I don't know. Again is the key word. Again. <laughs> I, yeah. Is that a... Are your viewers going to want to know why he lost his underwear the other night? Or is it better to just leave that... I think it's open probably ended. better just to leave that open-ended. Because the real story, I, I think the imagination goes yeah. much further than than the truth. Yeah, and the, that stuff's probably legal, whereas we don't want to document anything illegal. I'd like to make it home tomorrow on the plane without handcuffs. Right, ideally. In a perfect world. Yeah. 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 So what do you guys, uh, you're in Wisconsin now. What's your impression? I mean, it's a different state it's than chill, Washington. It's chill, man. I love yeah. it. I love yeah. it. I love the fact that everybody's big Bloody Mary fans, and you get yeah. these little beers with it. Chaser. Hello. You get a Bloody Mary, and they automatically give you a second um, drink. Yeah. Great. So that's good. I take it for granted. A friend of mine knew that you guys were coming to visit and knew it was a big deal. And she said, aren't you, aren't you kind of nervous? I mean, you're going to be hosting all these parties. And you know you got a lot to do. That, that's a little daunting. Are you nervous about it? I said, "Are you kidding? These guys, like, I do this by myself normally, but now I've got two heavy hitters to help you drive got your this thing. Uh, it's like walking yeah. into a bar fight and realizing all three of my brothers are standing right behind me. No problem. I got this. So, yeah, this has been easy peasy. It's been fun. Yeah, it's been fun. Long overdue. Yeah, I'd say so. Everyone, I have no idea what the answer is. Uh, what is your definition of a Bloody Mary? Mm. Just what it is? What is a Bloody Mary? Yep. <laughs> a lifestyle? No, it's a cocktail. Mm -hmm. um, I wouldn't call it a morning cocktail anymore. I would have years ago. Yeah. You know, but the only thing. I expect is probably tomato juice. Beyond that, but it has some to have kind tomato. of a spirit, some kind of a booze, some kind of tomato. What are those green the tomatillo ones? Though? That's... That sounds a lot like tomato, doesn't it? Tomatillo. Oh, they're not even related, though. Close enough for me. <laughs> So as long as you have tomato, what about like tomato and carrot? <laughs> you seen those ones? Yep. Tomato, pineapple. Mm -hmm. I'll try anything once, shall I? Okay. All right. Yeah. But those sound horrible. No, yeah, they're not very good. <laughs> <laughs> no, pineapple is actually pretty good. The carrot ones are horrible. Yeah, there's a mix that uh, I think you and I have both had. Yes. That, uh, can we say the name? Or oh, yeah, yeah. No, Bloody, absolutely. Bloody Bob's. Bob's. So he he makes a nice... Yeah. I think he's got a little pineapple in there. Yeah, one. there's a little bit in there. It's good. a little good. California going. Yeah. Yeah, that's pretty good. Yeah. yeah. I like that one. I had a strawberry one. That sounds wrong. It was weird. Yeah. It's better than you think. Yeah. If you had enough booze, it hides a multitude of sins, I find. That is true. Usually my own. <laughs> uh, is there anything you want to ask me? Are you seeing anyone? No, that's we've asked. Vodka that. soda! I already told yeah. you. Yeah. We've been in a diehard relationship with vodka yeah. soda. I get it. I totally get it. I had a I had a thing. Although somebody forgot half my drink order. <laughs> And it wasn't the vodka. And it wasn't the vodka. In my defense, I didn't forget the vodka. <laughs> no, that's good. If that's you're going to forget one of those. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, it's better to forget the soda. <laughs> so, right. These guys said I was a good host, but I'm really not. No, I host know. these house concerts, and these yeah. artists request the craziest things, and I always get it for them. You know, whatever. The Skittles or different kinds of booze and I totally dropped the ball and did not have soda. That's it. That's it. That's all I requested. I served vodka Shelly a, soda. a vodka. Just a vodka. It's like, that's it. Also, oh, I forgot that last part. I have a short term I know. Memory. It's in the name but it's, it's confusing, you know. 
Yeah, yeah, what's in that one? It could be multiple things. Sometime I'll tell you the fascinating story of how the Red Wing Blackbird got its name. That was my moment for me. Wait, Did I just call Lynn Miller on us right now? I'm pretty there? sure. <laughs> One time I was in an apple orchard and I made love on a Mexican blanket. Uh, uh, that's just that's gonna be the ad for this video. It's just gonna be you just saying that. Trailer? Yeah, that's the trailer video. <laughs> <laughs> okay, fair enough. Fair enough. Yeah. So we're going to finish up these Dimitri's Bloody Marys and we'll see you on the next episode.